Hello, welcome to Tag Tech. So, thank you. So, open up a new tab. You want to type in sprint dot c o m. Okay. Once you're at the home page of Sprint, you're going to see support. Click on that. It's going to take you to their support page. Um, when you go to the support page, you're going to scroll down and you're going to see devices. Click this arrow once, then you're going to see the phone HTC Touch Pro 2. Next, you're going to scroll down. Since um, the Sprint has just released the update, if you come on it this week, you will see the alert, and you can click on that. But if you don't, just click on Downloads right here. It's going to open up a new window. Maximize it. All right, then you're going to see software update. It says provides updates to your device, including upgrading to Windows Mobile 6.5. Click more details. And then you can read the description of what has what it has in it. But I already upgraded and read it already, so I'm not going to do that. At the bottom, very bottom, you're going to see download. Click on that. It's going to take you to HTC website. The first one, you're going to see Sprint Touch Pro 2 MR. And then the date is going to be 3 19 21. All right, you're going to click download. Remember, you have to be on Internet Explorer for this to work. Then you're going to click Save, not Run, Save. Then you're going to save it to uh, wherever you want it to, but remember where you saved it. So click Save again. I already have it saved, so I'm going to click No, and then Cancel. All right. I'm going to take you to where the download is. Click on start. Then you should see computer. If you have Windows 7 or Windows Vista, you'll see libraries. So you're going to click on that libraries. Then you should, you, wherever you saved it at, um, go to that folder. But I saved it in downloads under favorites. Look for the file. You're going to see it right here. HTC Touch Pro 2 MR1. And the file size should be 186901KB. You're going to right click, run as administrator. And remember, you have to know your password for this to work. Click yes. Now, this is the part that you have to plug in your phone to the USB. So, <clears throat> plug up your phone to the USB. <clears throat> Sorry. Make sure you have Active Sync or Windows Mobile Device Center. Make sure you have um, connected to Active Sync or Windows Mobile Device Center. And it's going to ask you when you plug it up to your phone.
phone. All right. So now I have the connection. I want to pause this and I want to show you what it's supposed to look like when you are. All right, welcome back, or WB. All right, so once you have your connection to Active Sync, click Next. It's going to um, oh well verify your well, computer. I already um, upgraded, so it might look different, so it's but it's going to look like swirly arrows moving if it's syncing, or and it's going to say verifying the information on your device. Please wait. Do not click anything or it will mess up the um, update. Or say now I'm responding. So just wait one second while it's loading. I have a 16 gig, so it takes six, I mean, um, not 16 minutes. It takes two minutes for me to, for this to load. But um, I'm going to pause it. All right, so done loading. It took like two minutes. All right, so you can read all this jibber jabber as I call it but they're important because you need this in order um, to update and you need to read it alright so you just check it and then click next and then I'm gonna click the um, HTC Sense 2.5 I'm actually glad that Sprint has put this in here so, you just scroll up for more apps that you have um, on a quick tab. Scroll back up to see the time. Next, we have contacts. Scroll up. Scroll back down. We have mail. Email, actually. Then we have text message, next we have calendar, next we have um, web, have your bookmarks that you can scroll up and down, we have photos, with this one, um, we weren't able to get the Leo one where you can turn it sideways. See, it does nothing. So we have a slightly older one of Sense. Next, we have Music. This takes a second since I have four gigs of music. Take a second. All right. So, we have the music here. Next, we have Sprint Navigation. Next, we have Sprint TV. Next, we have Weather. And then after that, we have Stocks. They come pre-installed with some. We have Twitter. Scroll up, see your tweets. Then, not last but least, we have settings. These are the newer settings. With this one, um, you can go to personalize right here. All right, we have the scroll up, nice, smooth, finger friendly um, start menu. We have Sprints pre-installed um, their apps. Then we have the market.